Hello, welcome back. Last time I got to meet a baby seahorse who was so young that it didn't even seem to have a name yet. Uh, didn't seem extremely useful because... It looks like the baby has himself all packed up and ready to ship. How am I going to get him out of here? <laughs> uh-huh. He didn't seem like the most useful character because he can't push anything. He can't even support anything. I guess he can get starfish. I suspect he can probably push seaweed. Uh, okay, so... I didn't try pushing the seahorse. Let's see if that works. Cannot push seahorse. Okay. Not only is the baby seahorse too weak to push objects, he is also too weak to support objects. As I learned before. Okay, so I need to do something about that, obviously. What exactly? It look Packed up and ready to ship. Um... I don't immediately see, like anything I can do. Uh, okay, so that gets me a bottle. Kinda. Seahorse is the one who has to get the starfish. Of course. Um, isn't that starfish just like kind of a gimme if I get the seahorse out, which I have to to solve the puzzle, right? I mean, I can't just leave. <laughs> uh, okay, right. Seahorse can move when I move the boxes. How can I take advantage of that? I can't. Can I? I don't see how. So I can push these over here, not usefully. Uh... Oh, oh, oh. Uh -huh. So here's what I do. I do that. So that's a start. Then what? Then I need... Okay. I need to have already put... Okay. It look I'm starting to understand this. I think I need to do this. And, in fact, probably this additionally. Uh, I can't do that. There's something more to this. Because if I push that down there, that all gets stuck. I wanted to push that all the way down there, so I, okay, I see why this starfish is going to be an issue. Because I'm just going to block it with all this cargo. Because, like, oops, only... not that. <laughs> Let's just see how this plays out. This would be a lot easier if you could push objects, little guy. Uh-huh, for reals. That would be nice. Alright, where is this going to leave everything? I can't visualize it until I actually do it. Fragile. Handle with care. Uh... Okay, that's oh, well. how I do that. We don't need to get the starfish anyway. <laughs> but it sure would be nice. Alright, I'll at least finish the puzzle the normal way. So, right, this object needs to somehow make it in there. Uh, that Government probably... regulations for shipping items overseas, volume two. My suspicion, my suspicion is it involves some of these objects I just shifted around. Not sure yet, though. Come on, baby. Let's see what Flounder has been up to. Alright, let me go back here. Oh! Park too close. Hey, that's a that's a thing, a padlock thing that was now unlocked. Uh huh. Neat. It uh, looks like okay. the baby so, has. This object needs to go here. Uh. Let's see here. Like, there's not much I can really affect as it is if I lift. Like, no, I can't even lift that. I can't, I can't do anything here, it seems like. Because that hole's too small for... Aha, idea. Uh, I have an idea. So I think I fill this hole with 
that thing? Something like that. So yeah, let's say, okay, let's say I would do this shuffle. Although I would kind of like that object back, but I can't get it if I do this. Government regulations. Well, let's just see. Well, this has done nothing useful. <laughs> huh. Okay. Huh. Okay. Hmm. 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 How do I... Like, I can't... Oops. Obviously, can't do that. What else can I do to move these differently? Here we go. I can retrieve you like that. Okay, so I can get one of these back. Are you talking? Your lips are moving. <laughs> I think you're confused, Guppy. Uh, okay, so if I was doing that, and I did this... Oops. None of that's useful. But, like, it's starting to look like something almost, maybe. How do I make it actually look like something? I mean, I can... Oh, hey! Well, I mean, that's enough to, uh... To block that off. So maybe what I actually do... I got it. I know what to do. Um... Government regular... Uh -huh. Uh, maybe all I do is just simply this. Yeah, that's that's actually all I need. <laughs> okay. This right here, that's a red herring. Uh, or at least it's there to just get me thinking about the shape of the thing I would need. Even though it's that's not actually what it is. <laughs> Because, yeah, this sh I don't immediately see any reason this would not work. Sure seems like it will. This would be a lot easier if you could push objects, little guy. So what can you do, little guy? Anything at all? Or are you just there to get in the way? Okay, so, uh, wait a second, how has this helped me? Suddenly, I think I'm thinking about this wrong. Because it doesn't seem like I can do anything now, because this just gets the seahorse packed into a corner there. Oops! <laughs> There's an error in my thinking. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, the reason that worked was because... Because this went down far enough to push that off it, but then that, that's in the way of the starfish. Uh, okay. Because, yeah, for some reason I was fixated on filling this hole just like these two. I guess I didn't think all the way through that. But, yeah, I can get these two objects. What can I do with them? Like, there's no situation where I can just conveniently get a... A way to, like, lift up this crate, or, uh... Or is there... I think I see something. Let me just play this out a little bit. Like, I'm picturing situations where, um... If this were to fall into a hole... Does it ever open up a place where I could use this as a lever to push that to the right? So if that falls down there... No. If it falls down here, no. If it falls down here, also no. So it doesn't seem like it does. And that doesn't even work, because that guy can't go far enough down for that. So no, that's not it. Huh. 
doesn't seem like there's much I can really do other than the obvious. Okay, so let's go back over the normal path one more time. What does that look like? This is an annoying shuffle to have to do, but I'm hoping I'll just see some place where I can insert some thing different and have a good result from it somehow. Like, what can I... I just don't see anything I can affect. Like, where would any of these objects at all come into play? Or is there some... This would be a lot easier. Hmm. Yeah, there's just some fundamental move I'm not able to see. Like, it seems like I need to swap these two crates, but I don't see how that would be even slightly possible. So push that there, starfish is blocked. Okay, yeah, that's all just totally blocked off. Push fragile. that there. Handle with care. That is the fragile symbol. I can't get any extra pushes on this without Fragile. Handle with care. Getting that all the way in there. And then this is just Oh well. We don't need to get the starfish anyway. So Guppy knows. Once I'm at this point, I can't get the starfish. Could I so there's no way I could have this box fall down here. Because, like, that thing's going ahead of it. There's no... I can't put something in here, get this over it, then clear it out and have this drop down. Because it would be nice to be able to just sneak in there. Hmm... How else can I think about this? Okay, so I guess I haven't tried. Maybe I, I feel like I have tried seeing what would happen, how this would play out with an arrangement like this. Right? It's just not useful, right? Hey, move, starfish. I mean, seahorse, whatever you are. <laughs> If the starfish could move, that'd be cool too, because then I'd be able to get it easier, maybe. This would be a lot easier if you could push objects, little guy. All right, so look closely. I feel like the the point at which I need to do something different is like right in here. That's not helpful because everything is just stuck now. There's no way to get the kind of leverage that I would need to. Hold on. Nope, nope, that shape doesn't work. Like, there isn't... These are only too tall. Any vertical protrusion that comes out of a too wide hole is going to uh, only be able to push something in this row with all the obstacles. In that row with all the obstacles, I can't have another too, too tall thing here that would act as a lever because it would just run into that. But I feel like I need to be thinking about things like that to make this happen. There's... why is... Well, for one thing, why is this here? For another thing, why is there a second hole here? I guess that's just to get the seahorse out of. Aha! Uh -huh. New idea. I, I got it. I got it. I got something. I have something, definitely. So what I have is there could be a space for a seahorse to hide down in this hole if it were one of these objects instead of that object. That's what I need. And I can get... Okay, how can I, how can I set that up? That doesn't feel good, what I'm doing there. I don't like that. Um, 
but I don't feel like I get a choice because like the the way I have to to get this out necessarily puts it ahead of that and that just falls down there which is no good so right my mission right now is to get one of these two I guess this one definitely into this hole which I feel like means pushing it across mm. How does, uh, maybe if I'm doing that, I don't need to worry so much about, yeah, 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 okay, regulate. I see how I would do that, and if this right here is not a problem, well, I don't want to do exactly that, I probably want to do this first, and then, well now, this is not helping because I can't move that to the right anymore. Okay. Complications continue. Of course they do. Like if I could if I could just get in here and push this to the right, then I could stick this. Uh, there is a little shelf right here. How can I use it? Can I build like a whole tower there? Stuff it full of things. I don't think so. I don't see how I could, because, like, I mean, this this, this just falls. Hmm. Still not sure what to do with this object. Like, I'm getting somewhere. I really strongly feel like the idea of tucking a seahorse down into this hole is the right approach. But that just means one of these has to fall down this hole, or this hole. Because the, the, only, the only movement down here is leftward. I can't get any rightward movement in that area. Government but like regulations with this for... arrangement, I can't do what I want to do, like you end up very much in that spot. I can... What can I do? I can... do some things. I can do this. But that's... Oh, ho! Look at that. That's what that little spot is for. Aha! <laughs> I got it. Okay. I think that's a complete solution. This object is still useless, apparently. Uh, mm. Now, I'm not sure how this little bit right here is going to play out. That's what I'm worried about. Let's just hope. Like, I can't visualize the way that's going to get pushed for some reason. That's just not within my brain capabilities. So I just have to do it and see. So there's a hiding spot for you. This would be Eventually. a lot easier if you could push objects, little guy. No, you can't, so we just have to work with what we have. This is a problem. Having these objects here is no good. I put too many there or something? Like, I need to leave this one behind, I think. Uh, let's see what happens, though. You can go down there. Neat. Got it. Yeah, that's nice, but the star uh, seahorse is trapped now. To get it untrapped, I would just need to be able to push this to the right, which means neither of those need to be in there. Uh-oh. Okay. Well, that sounds hard. How will I arrange such a thing? can't really imagine. Like, I, I need both of these objects the way they are. I shouldn't have... I should have saved a state when I was a little farther ahead. 
So I figured out that much. Like, I know what this little space is for, but that's not a complete solution. Those fall. And I can't do anything about it. Like, all of this feels right. Is it necessarily? I mean, I think so. Those are stuck there, which means that gets stuck on top of them, which means I can't move these out of the way to get the seahorse out. I don't have another opportunity to do that. I can't insert this into that space or anything. Okay. I can add this to the everything. That can't possibly be useful, but I guess I'll try. Like, that's just going to create more problems. <laughs> but if it's useless, then why is it there? Like, it must have a use. I just don't know what it is yet. This just seems like a completely terrible idea. This would be a lot right? easier if you could push objects, little guy. This just jams everything up. Yeah. Yeah. There's no going anywhere with that. Huh. Huh. So, okay. Not only is the bait. I just need to take a close look at my whole situation here. Like, what change would make everything work? I know of one, possibly. Uh, it's not... No, it doesn't really work. Mm. Once the... Once the seahorse is down here, I do have the option of going under this. If I pushed that all the way... Okay, so let's set this up without that extra box there. Here, just give me, give me one of these. If I want to play with this state, that's what I'll load. Maybe I should save it after I've done some of this shuffling, because, like, well, or not, because, like, I might need to make some tweaks to the state of the puzzle beforehand. This would be a lot easier. I just don't see a way I can prevent these from falling down while also moving those into place the specific way that I did. Maybe there's another way to move them that doesn't involve letting those fall. But that's the only way I currently see. So, you go there. Now I'm going to push this that far. Hey, that still doesn't work. I can't avoid pushing that that far. It's it, it, it feels closer. It feels like I'm almost onto something. In order to help, once again, it just needs to be that this hole has nothing in it. We got it. And that seems so impossible. <sighs> like what could I Okay. It look Like what what can what can this it can't. It can't do anything. This this thing's just in the way. Like, is it a is it a platform that I need to stash something on top of to move it around in some way? Like government regulation. So as soon as I do that, then I mean that just has to fall there. Hmm. How stubborn do I want to be here? Do I want to give up on this? Not yet. I'm not ready to. Uh, 
I can't do anything useful with that. No, that's just... no. Nope, nope. Definitely not that. So... So... Yeah, there's no... with only one fish, there's no mechanism I can use to stack objects on top of each other, because... Yes, I can get under them and move them up and down, but I can't move them side to side. Seahorse can't push anything, Seahorse is trapped anyway. Man. Why don't I see... I feel like I'm so close. I want to I wanna figure this out. Alright, so here's something of interest. If I could put that bottle in the other position... Uh, wait, how did I do this? Uh, if I don't move that... Uh, right, so as soon as I do that, Seahorse is down. I can open up a little gap right here. If I could swap these two, then the seahorse would have a way out. <laughs> well, that's its noise. Okay. Yes. We got it. Yes. Hmm. Got it. I guess that's just random. <laughs> okay. So, the thing is, I don't see how that would happen because Guppy can't get into this entire area. That, so, uh, so pushing this to the right to go there seems impossible, but skipping over this gap and getting it in there also seems kind of impossible. I'm having trouble thinking of how that could possibly happen. Like, it's either that, or don't put these two objects down here. I, I, I think. Well, those are, those are the two ways that I've seen that could do something useful so far. I just... Like, everything I do puts that in there. So... Yeah, from this... From this state, I can't... Yeah, just dumping something into into this spot just doesn't seem like it's going to happen. Like, that's... The only way that's done is by being, being pushed left by this whole thing, and... I just can't open up a gap that way. Is there some other way to make this skip over to create a spot for the seahorse? I don't think so. Is that object usable in it some way? Like no. The only way to interact it. with that is to push it to the left and then it goes in the hole. Okay. Um. That drops that there, which is probably not useful. Am I sure about that? Well, I mean, there's no room for the seahorse to get into there at all. Like, that's not a hidey hole. Not like these others are. Like, this This has to drop three in order to get out of the way of that. Uh, man! I don't see it yet. Oh, here we go! Ah! Finally! Man, like, half an hour of flailing around and finally I see that I can do this. Okay, so how did I get into this situation? Basically, I just did the same push. <laughs> like, I knew it had to be one small thing I just was not observing. Uh, wow. Okay, so don't push that big crate any further. Just push the little cargo. Okay, so do push it one further. Then that opens up a little channel for the starfish to get through. This crate is still useless. <laughs> and Seahorse can come over here and get that. You got it! Yay! Good job! Wow. Okay. So I didn't have to move this bottle to this tile. I didn't have to clear these out of there. I just had to do a different shuffle down there. Man. That took me way too long. Let's see what Flounder has been up to. Hoy. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I wish I could feel good about having persisted and gotten that, but I just I wore myself out enough that I don't really care all that much. I got a second wild card. Oh boy. <laughs> 
Okay, so that was another one puzzle day. Yeah, I'm exhausted. It's late at night. I didn't want to spend that long on that. So I got the starfish. Yay. I'll be happy about that tomorrow, I guess, when I don't have to look at this puzzle again. Alright, next time, probably looming threat. I feel like I'm not ready to go here yet. But then I'm going to need to choose between those. So this was from three places, actually. It was Sunken City and Split Level. So I wonder if Virgil and Seaweed and Seahorse will all meet up in this area. That's my suspicion. Okay, anyway, see you next time to probably try this and see what it unlocks here.